Secret of Mana Remaster for the PC. Finished up that last section of the Sunken Continent, uh, the Grand Palace, which is kind of like a little bit of like all the other palaces where you actually have to use all the elements to get through it at some point, having different spells cast on certain orbs that correspond to that element. And, uh, failed to stop the Emperor. Well, at least I didn't stop the Emperor. Fanha did. Apparently she betrayed him, killed him, and then her and Thanatos are, uh, have succeeded in resurrecting the Mana Fortress. But then, uh, afterwards spoke to... Crap, what's his name? Gemma. There we go. I forgot his name for a second. So the world seems doomed to be destroyed in the clash between the Fortress and the Mana Beast. Randy's last resort is to attempt to power his mana sword with the mana tree itself. The party heads to the Pure Land at the edge of the world. That's in the upper left corner. Okay, you said if I can just like synchronize my sword with the tree, it would automatically restore the full power. It's like, ooh. But I couldn't get there because it was like surrounded by a, a dense mana ugh, a dense mana fog. That was kind of blocking everything, so you couldn't actually go there. One. What sort of place is Sprite Village? It's great. I mean, I only just got my memory back, but I'm pretty sure it's great. You'll be home before you know it. Just a little farther. Gotcha, I'm way past that. You always know what to say, bro. Thanks. Both of you. You're not usually so sincere. It's like seeing snow in the summer. There's snow year around in the forest near my home, you know. Don't be so pedantic. So what's gonna happen once we arrive? Are you planning on leaving the group? It'd be a lot quieter around here. <laughs> I don't know. As your boss, I'm not sure if you'll be okay without me to look after you. <laughs> Thanks for your concern. We can always decide once we get there. First things first. We need to keep going. Yeah, I hope everyone at home is okay. I'm sure they're fine. You already know they're not. Definitely. Thanks, guys. I mean it. Okay, so I guess it just... happens, and like, a, I guess every time you sleep... I mean, not very often that I actually sleep at an inn. I usually talk to someone to, like, restore my health. So when I powered up my, oh excuse me, forged up my weapons, and the uh, what the hell was the previous one? The Gigas Lance and the Dragon Lance, effective, like significant damage on dragons. Oh, um, with an M's fork or whatever it was called, the Elf's harpoon. How was the previous one? Like chain whip or whatever it was, something. I don't remember what the sixth one was called. Nimbus Whip, significant damage on insect and tough skin monsters, and the Masamune to the Giga Sword, increases strength by two. Actually, you can get that. You can get that, and she can get this. There! Now, before I actually head off to the Pure Land, let me go pick up the last piece of, like, Viable armor. From here. You're safe. Are you wounded at all? Thanatos and his loyalists double cross the Emperor. What could he be planning? I don't know. Some of my men are waiting inside. That's nice. Derp. Hi, Neko. I guess you gotta go, Meow, huh? We're counting on Mew. Make sure Mew have everything before Mew leave. See, that's you can buy that crap now. It's like... You don't help it for him. And best card for everyone else. Anything else? Actually, do I need anything else? Chocolate. Might as well just buy that. 
anything epic be seeing me. I have waited. Come to me quickly now. Okay, so I'm gonna get the Griffin helmet for one of these things, and it's Randy's old last helmet. Then I can like start making my way towards. It's about half, about halfway ish, I guess, where I fight some of the other things to get two of the other um, wrist armor drops. No, but I, it won't take me that long to get the helmet. It didn't take me long to get that, so hopefully it won't take me very long. So I'll see you when I see you. Okay. Griffin helmet. Okay, that is technically his last helmet. That's garbage. Nope. Garbage.
that some of the pathing in here works is several points can lead to the same point, and then after that it's like a straightforward path, and then it can branch again. Several points meeting at one place. So it's like path A, B, and C can lead to D, and then D goes to E, and then, you know, F, G, and H goes to I or something, you know? sit tight and I'm going to see if I can try to get a the hell's it called a dragon ring or at least that's what it's called the old one the names that I'm using are things from like the original game so I don't know what they're called in the remake so I'll wait and just see what he drops so hopefully that won't take very long alrighty that actually didn't take as long as I thought it would either nope wrong button okay, he's already got a of the dragon coil. It's like a little bit stronger, but not by much. Go ahead and give that to. Uh... Yeah, second griffin that I killed, I dropped the chest, dropped another freaking griffin helmet. I'm like, oh, you suck. Go ahead and give that to him. Guiding them deeper into the realm. That's what it is,
understood why those die a little bit differently than, like, other bosses. And I believe you fight a total of six bosses in here. Also drop another freaking um, like arm protector. So I'm gonna see you in a bit. Oh my god, this took forever. I don't even know what level I am right now. I am 70. I was like 64, 65, maybe. Good freaking god. Oh, it does Frost Emblaze. But she needs a new ring. Wait. Oh, and wait. Yeah, Frost Emblaze. Ah, <sighs> okay, so that's. What is that? Imp's ring. Alrighty, all I have to do left is find a freaking eggplant man and get a watcher ring. Jesus Christ. Screw you, ghost. God, this looks so damn long. Same bow or a bar. And yeah, 
why I still have the um, original soundtrack for the Pure Land, because I actually like it a lot better than the remake. And I tried to sit there and like listen to the remake, you know, while all this was, you know, happening, trying to get the freaking imps ring to drop. And it's like I couldn't like get into it. I just I don't know. Like that one, the town theme. Is it a chest? It is. Like that one, the town theme. Uh. And uh. Dwarf Village. I just, I don't know, was not a big fan. Continue on. Yes. that in the other uh, which I'm gonna call it don't I yeah I, I, I fought the uh, the eggplant mans before and the uh, the subway station ish I thought it wasn't an eggplant, man. Okay, let's see how long this will take now. Okie dokie. That one actually didn't take as, as long. Was it anywhere near as bad? See, that's technically better. Who prevents Moogly? was a watcher ring. Okay, so now I just got the equipment to pick up in the Mono Fortress. Yeah. 
Javelin orb. Alrighty. Now I'm actually gonna go ahead and just stop it right here because this puts me about halfway through the pure land. Yeah, about halfway ish or so. So when I come back, I'm gonna finish up the pure land and then make my way to the mana fortress. So until then, this is Indie Gamer Retro on Secret of Mana Remastered. Later guys.